So I know they want me to go that way, and I probably should, and I know all of you want me to, but come on. A very bizarrely placed vending machine that has a power cell just hanging there? But I can, I can buy stuff? Rubbing alcohol, sewing kits, jerky, a rubber duck for what? Flash. What the hell is that? Run faster, if a bit louder. Street drug. Not available from doctors. But you can buy it in a vending machine. I can get another canteen. Hmm. Much harder to break. Do I need all that stuff right now? I can carry 100 pounds and I have 31 pounds. But... Yeah, alright. Before we go over there... Let's do what needs to be done. It's finally nighttime, so help me God. I'm gonna, is this that plant? Is this the blooming plant? Yo! Okay, great, there's the creepy house. Is there anything else to explore and go see? You can fill up your canteen. Yeah, I did that. I'm good on, on water, oh my God. Do you hear that, like, spooky noise? Oh, what the? How did I not notice? Oh, my God. Mad Max up in this shit. How did I not notice that? I guess I got distracted by the tea party. Take some more charcoal. There are other houses up here, but I feel like that's part of the town that I, uh... I guess that's the area I was looking out of over earlier, maybe? game is just fascinating. There's so much to look at and see. All of it terrifies me, by the way. But, uh... Let's keep doing it. Glass bottles. Oh, I can use that as a weapon? Rules of the Garden District. Don't steal. You're welcome to visit, but... That music scared me into looking at a dead body. Oh, hell no. <laughs> oh, hell no. Also a rock. Ma'am, are you? Nope, nope. Nope, that music is... Yes, we remember. You don't have to bloody remind us. The present is awful enough as it is. Oh, that's rule number five. You can eat any fruit you find except the fruit of the apple tree. The bobbies will kill... Let's stay out here then. <laughs> oh my god. They did say at night, don't go into town. Bobbies will hunt your ass down. I don't want that shit. Look at the map really quick. So I'm just straight up on an island. Which is fine because it makes it easier to explore and get stuff. Sort of a starting island, I guess. I'm going to get as much of this as I can at night. I'm still not sure what it does. But let's just... Explore the perimeter. Works drift. Bridge. Heaven's alive. It's a bloody fortress. Ah, I stumbled on where I needed to go. Oh my god, it is a fortress. What the hell? So what was that house in the middle? Oh boy, they got spotlights and shit. Can I go up here? Oop, probably some coal. Or not. We got a misty tree. And a cliff face, it looks like. Anything secret around this? Come on. Come on, get up there. Nothing. Alright, there's one house right in the middle we did not go to. I feel like we should explore it, right? Was it this one? No, it was this one. There's no I'm waiting for there to be something in there, and one day there is, and it's gonna... Oh, why is it more of this nonsense? Oh, boy. Creepy. Nope. Nope. I'm not okay with this. 
Rubbing alcohol? That's pretty good. We got a rotten apple. Teacups. I'm just going to collect all of them. I'll have a tea party. Oh, my God. That smells awful in there. That's not good. Where's that music coming from? It is so scary. <laughs> Basically, what I'm saying is the music your great grandparents listen to, terrifying. Don't mind me. Just having a bit of a sit down. Well, that's a convenient story, isn't it? The Germans rounded up the kids at gunpoint, did they? So much better than what we actually did, isn't it? Did we sell out our kids? I remember what we did. Oh my god, is that really... So, I was trying to figure out if we put them on there to save them, or if we put them on there to go... that They were conscripts or whatever. But maybe it's, like, way sinister than that. Maybe the plot was, like, get rid of the youth so there's no one to fight back, question mark, and we just sent them off to die? I honestly don't know. I don't know. I remember, oh god, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember, I Flora, Hope, Lewis, Harold. Wow, that's the opposite of cool. Where are they now? Monday. I'm not a downer. There's no excuse for those people. I'd take joy happily if only I could. Oh God, I wish I could. Without puking my guts up. How could joy work for years and then cruelly stop? I miss the butterflies and rainbows. Must think of the butterflies and rainbows, not the horrors that push into my head. Tuesday. I miss Hamlin Village. I strain my ears for the sound of Simon Says across the water. Growing up, I couldn't wait to get out and see the world. Now all I want is a cup of tea and to stop feeling. Thursday, I think. Slept all day yesterday. Or maybe two days? The gray blurs into itself. Friday. The flowers in the garden district mock me, bursting with color in this place of misery. Why do they cast us out of the village? What's it to them that we can't take joy? It should make them all happier knowing they can. Oh, God. I remember what we did. Do I examine this? No. I look in the to oh, I can look in the toilet. It's upstairs, whatever it is. Oh man. Why they gotta why they gotta make this place creepier than it already is? How could Victorious alright, well, hold on. Darts. How could we? How could we? Pick up O. The O current. Saboteur swing, justice, or mob violence. Oh my god. Alright, so let's start here. To the editor. Enough with the bleeding heart editorials. The agitators that were hanged had it coming. If they had destroyed the register of children, the whole town would have been destroyed. Stick to reporting the football scores and save the editorializing. We don't need police looking for every Tom, Dick, and Harry that took care of those outlaw parents. What are the police going to do? Arrest the whole town? To the editor, I must vigorously disagree with your recent editorial regarding the vigilante action against the saboteurs. These selfish parents attempted to destroy the registry of children so that their own would not have to be hostages. Their actions were a slap in the face of every family that has sent a son off to a war. We must all do our duty. By long English tradition, cowards are hanged to encourage the others. Surely saboteur cowards deserve no better. Miss Victoria Bing, Appleholm. Our former boss, Victoria Bing? So I think... We have our answer to everything. The kids were sent off to Germany as sort of, you know how back in the day, the way they secured marriages in medieval times was, or, or and made sure wars didn't happen, is you would set, you know who it is? You know exactly who it is? Theon Greyjoy. It's the concept of one of your children is going to come live with us or you're going to marry into our family so we have no reason to fight now. And we'll ensure our alliance because we have something precious of yours that you're not going to want to lose. Right? And I think that's what the Germans did, is they took all the kids, and they're like, we're going to keep them safe so you don't try to do anything crazy. I'm just curious what the impetus was to be like, let's just start getting really messed up and high and forget all about that. Was it worse than that? They were so small. 
Maybe maybe they're just upset because they really just give up their they gave up their children. Oh. Well, that's terribly romantic, isn't it? They had each other until the end. Oh my god. Yep, I knew that was going to be spooky. <laughs> the minute that stopped, I kind of had a feeling. Oh, I can s that's a bit risky. Look what happened to Goldilocks. Canteen? Hell yes. Uh, taxi. Duct tape, I'll take that. Repair kit? Hell yes. Taxi! Thanks to a bit of British ingenuity, the Belpit brothers, who were too ill with measles to take the train last week, will be able to join their playmates after all. General Bing's office dispatched a taxi to drive the youngsters to Bristol, where they arrived just in time to board the German ocean liner, taking them to Bremerhaven. It was certainly a challenge to find a working taxi in these times, notes the general, but we must all go above and beyond. The O Current wishes the Belpit boys a bon voyage aboard the St. Louis. That's messed up. That's messed up. They got him there just in time to ship them off. That's. Can I say something, by the way? I just... I really want to see what happens if we hide. Oh my god. This whole damn thing's messed up. Mother would be so proud. Look, dude, you gotta do what you gotta do. Also, they don't have anything, but you gotta do what you gotta do, dude. It's so messed up. Is this recent? I'm... Oh, no. She got flowers in her hair. Or maybe she just, like, put them there? I just... Oh, my God. Well, that was terrible. That was bloody terrible. No one saw me hide. I bet I could stay here forever. <laughs> At least until I starved to death. Oh, I thought that was writing. It's not. All right, well... That was incredibly unpleasant. It's like the only place left to go is to the fort. And then there's this area over Yeah, there's this area over here which is the flower district question mark. Not sure how much I want to do that shit. Okay, there's got to be a secret way in, right? Head boys. The head boys? Oh boy. Let's just keep on keeping on. Sneaky time. Hooligan Hooligan camp. British hooligans, they're tough. That is a light source right on my ass. Can I not walk through the light? Oh god. Okay, that's a cliff. No one's looking for me though, right? I go sneaky time. Yeah, this definitely has to be a secret way in. It has to be. Oh my god. Look at this. Oh, wow. So this was clearly set up to fight off uh, invaders. If I see, that's so cool. And unused, but cool. Octong. Danger. Oh, maybe maybe it was built to prevent people from taking it back? Anything over here? Okie dokie. Chest. Yo, oh my god. Perfect. Bobby pins. Also perfect. Let's go straight up in here now and just make some stuff because I got I can make why would I want to make dirty dirty bandages seem like the opposite of good things to make and I can make a proper suit I can make a jimmy bar yeah, let's make a few of those lock picks oh my god yeah perfect one of these days I need to get all those other things I can make a some some awesome weapons it looks like When do I get points to spend? What does that what does that do? Mm, I have rocks that I can throw. 
I have my suit. I have no quest items. Oh, it's interesting to look through. Mechanical bits. I have health stuff. I have some food. But I think I'm, I'm good at the moment, so let's just sneak boys into here. Pick that lock. Nice, nice. So far, so good. Enter the hooligan bunker. Oh my god. Warning, you are trespassing. Yeah, no, that's obvious. Sally would have loved this if I could never get in here. Okay, there are scratches on the wall. Oh yeah, this is... I was going to say little kids were down here, but I imagine those are just adults who have gone bonkers. What are they going to do? What are they going to do? Yell at me? Is there anywhere to sneak up high? Okay, that's not good. A broom? Can I use a broom to fight? No. Run home, Fritz! Can I go in here? I guess I have to take that elevator. Oh my I hope god. No one notices. Anything in here? No, there's literally no way to go. Except the. No one's gonna notice the elevator? Oh, this one, I'm old time. This is gonna be like. So long, Jerry. Oh, this is bad news. Okay, well. Oh my god! What did I just say? What? Oh, what? Uh, lovely day, Fred. A lovely day it is. Not many people get this bar. It's sort of a test. Someone who gets this bar usually puts up a decent fight. In the arena. I don't I'm sorry? Is there some way I could be more useful to you alive? I don't know. Can you juggle? Well, I can write a lovely poem. I won a prize in school. Nah. We've already got a bad. First, put your things in that box. It will leave you there to starve. What? Wait. What? No, I collected all this stuff fair and square. I scrounged through dead bodies, y'all! Oh, you are monsters. You head boys are monsters. Oh, this is... For real? This is what I have to do? But I spent all that time... All this loot. They took everything, even Good my... Good dialoines for the moment of truth. For it is upon you. What? Pardon? I'm sorry, what? Headboy rules. For little George's initiation, he has to win an arena fight with a tourist. No fair fighting wastrel weaklings. Fresh meat only. Haha. <laughs> steal food not looted from a dead body. Sneak into the village. Steal a bobby hat. Maybe make it to the red bobby hat. That's a fight I like to see. Haha. -ha. Clean my leather jacket. Stop being a doll wanker. Oops. I guess little George might not be headboy material after all. Ha ha ha. Cool. Hello? Can I loot it? See if you can keep blood off that lovely suit. Oh, Especially for the love of God. <laughs> hey, in the other corner, is our two time winner, Janet Defoe! Bloody hell! Arthur Hastings? What? I'm sorry. I, I don't. I don't think I know you. Of course you know me. You got me sacked from the old current. Oh shit! I, uh, I, I don't remember that. I, I, I don't work there anymore. You thought one of my articles was insufficiently original, Danny Defoe. You you've lost a bit of weight. 
To be fair, you did copy my piece line by line. Who gives a shit, Hastings? A newspaper's supposed to make you feel good. Nobody remembers what they read. I don't want to fight you. The feeling is muted. There's only enough food for the winners, see? Now, yeah, lads, charge your weapons. One is quite lethal. The other will just give the other chap some bad dreams. Up to you. That padded one doesn't look nearly as effective. How badly do I not want to kill good old Danny? I don't want to kill Danny. I can be good. I can be good. And Danny's picked the lethal one. Oh my Thanks, god. Jerry. Danny, not like this. Hey, it's all guy. I've got great odds on you. Don't fuck it up. He's got to come on strong with that lead pipe. You've got to want to block that. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Got him. Come on, you son of a bitch. Got him. Oh, got him. Okay. Twice jumping. Watch out his guard. R. There we go. There we go. Twice jumping. I'll drop his guard. Come on, you piece of shit. Come on. Come on. Oh, ow! Not like this. I'm trying to be nice to you, man! And it looks like Defoe is down for the count. It's not personal. Four, three, two, one. Throw Danny at someone fighting you? Let's spice it up, shall we, eh? How about we let the birds have a chance? I'm sorry, you what? You lost your bet on Defoe. Now's your chance to have a double war. Birds? Quiz. Am I fight? The hell am I fighting? Oh, come on! Ow! Not even cool, ladies! All I want to do is throw Danny at you. Oh, they do double hits! Ow! Jesus, criminy! I'm so beat up. I'm so beat up! Oh! Oh! Not like this. Oh, you're dying. Select healing items pressing one. F. F. Heal. We've come to the end of our time. F. Heal. We've come to the end of our time. I know. I know you have. Rotten apple. All right. I tried. I tried. I tried to throw Danny. That did not work. And I'll take that. She have anything, ma'am? Are you? I feel like she broke. I feel like she broke her arm. Guys, I think she broke her arm. Are we good? Can I? I tried. I tried to be optional. Guess. Guess I'm still pretty weak. Oh, the elevator. Not that cage that they kept them in. Oh my god. Okay, let's go. Let's all wish him well on his journey. What? Oh god, this shot. Oh god. Oh, these people are the worst. Oh, they're the worst. I'm taking these metal bits. F y'all. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, it needs to be done. Ugh. Rotten to. Oh god. Jimmy bar, I'll take that. Is that metal bits? Steal that. I don't want that potato. Rotten carrots. Let's take this. Okay, well. 
What do I what what do I do? Trap? Maybe I jump here. Like Ugh. No. What about up here? Okay. Ah, alright, then I come here. And thank god this is here. Well, F that. Pop it open. Heal up. Pop it open, stick it inside sort of, of you. I wonder if I can pry it loose. I'd need a jimmy bar. Thank god we have one. I suppose now that no one is actively trying to kill me, I ought to be on the lookout for a motoline dispenser. That chap at the bridge said I'd need a power cell and his war medals. Completing quests throughout Wellington Wells will give you skill points. Oh, okay. I can buy stuff with those. Oh my god. Step number one. Quietly choke people unconscious from behind. Smother them in their beds. Oh my god. Smooth talker. Talking to people makes them trust you more. Yep, this is the one. Enter. Yes. I better figure out how to get rid of him real quiet like. I definitely don't want a crowd. What? Please just lie down. Nice. Can I stick him in here? Or we can put him on the toilet. That's fine. Ooh, search toilet. Drop him. Yeah, all right. He's fine. Oh, God. He's fine. He's fine. He's fine. Medicine cabinet. Drink from the water tap? Yeah. Uh, I just need to drink, right? Okay, good, good, good. There's pee all over the floor. I'm gonna search that toilet, huh? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I have my cue. I can pull it out if I need to. Oh my god. Press C to sneak. Oh, I'm aware. I thought they have lights on their hat. Oh my god, me! Oh my god! This won't take a minute. Lord knows I tried. Headboy fight! Tonight, tonight! Who'll end up in the ring? Headboy fight! That's right. Alright, drop him on the bed. Or on the floor. That's cool. What has he got? Nice, a Jimmy bar. Okay. Let's see. No one can hear me. I'm good. So far, I think. Rotten potato. Why do they just keep rotten potatoes? Search this rubber. Oh, yeah, that's the ticket. Search the locker. That locker is locked. You can fix that. Hell yes. All right, empty. I could turn on the TV, which would cause a problem. I don't know who that girl is, but she she's hot my dreams now. Uh, yeah, let's get in here. You? Oh, man. Dig spot discovered. Pardon? Where? Where is the dig spot? I guess I have to get outside? What is that? How to be sneaky? That's me getting out of here. Treasure map? Aye, there be a treasure. Dig spot. I didn't see what it said. Ah. Okay, well, that's the world. That's terrifying. Maybe it's hidden over here. We got a fridge. We got tea leaves. I'm taking those. Tea cup. War rations? Hell yes. Oh, uh, okay. I see. I see the need to eat. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. A uh, yum, yum, yum. We have this bed over here. I could sleep here if I wanted to, although I feel like that's probably not the smart move, but it would let me. I'd wake up dead, but that's fine. All right, I guess that's it. I can't believe they took all my stuff. I better get that back or there's going to be a fight. Uh-oh. 
One for healing, two for food, three for throwables and drugs for four. Press F to use or equip an item. Okay. Hint. It's easier to move among your enemies if they're looking somewhere else. I assume that's what those glass bottles are for, huh? Which is why I have many glass bottles. Uh oh. <laughs> Maybe you should go over there and look, even though you definitely saw me throw it. Sort of where they're at foot wise. What does it show you where they're going? Oh, that guy's over there. Oh, Lord. There they go. There they go. Nope. Okay, they. What if I. Try my hardest to freak you guys out. If I gotta bop them, I'll bop them, but I don't wanna bop them. Is that guy gonna. Oh, he's having a hell of a day. Okay. Turn around the other way and look that way. We should be okay. You hear that? You hear this, oh. Royston? Shh. Oh shit. Okay. All right. All right. Let's dump Royston in here. Yep. We good. Where's that other guy? A man's home is his castle. Oh, what? The and it's not your bleeding castle. What? Oh, it broke. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. There we go. It's fine. It's fine. He's fine. He didn't even come to me knocking this guy unconscious. That's what it came to. He's trying to run for security. No, nah, dude, we're good. It's fine. Take some glass bottles. I thought I had him. He turned around at the last minute. Okay, so we have the elevator that I was just in where they dropped me from. That's the hatch. Rubbish bin with feathers? Sure, okay. Uh, another glass... What are they doing? I guess they're just drinking down here. I have more glass bottles than I ever thought... Oh, I would need. I imagine tens... Okay, so this is dangerous looking. This guy's going to become a mutant. I wish him the best. Oh! Motilate, the pure resublimated thymotilate. The fuel of the future, now. Interesting. This fuel is leaking everywhere. I wonder what modeling actually is. What the hell was that? What the hell is that? Is there someone around here? Or is that me choking to death? We got an exit here, and we have this room here. Oh my god. That Yeah, that seems dangerous. There's a room up here. I mean, I don't want to use a twig. Okay. Just, uh, <laughs> not what I went to do, boy. but all right. I guess this area is secure. I'm gonna close this. I wanted to close the door, but I guess we're not doing that. Search the locker. We got a desk. We got some stuff on the desk. Yeah, I'll take that. Toolbox. Hell yes. Pills. I don't know that I need. Ah, oh, there they are. Well, I guess I can go to that Hamlet and give that chap his medals, and he'll give me the card I need to cross the bridge. Hell yes. Let's turn the radio off. Oh 
Okay. Sneaky boys. Sneaky boys for life. I imagine I'm going this way to the actual exit. But I would like to get my stuff back. Oh! Oh! Well, I think that's everything I had when they jumped me. Oh, hell yes! Okay. Can I get my shovel? That would be swell. If I go look at my inventory... Do I have a shovel? Yeah, let's equip that. Okay. I'm not gonna bash anyone with the shovel, I just need it to dig. I guess that's it, huh? I got, I got out of here fairly easily. Never mind, I am inside the courtyard. Oh, that is butts. Oh, that is ten times butts. If I crouch, I bet I can disappear into those bushes. Hint, enemies won't spot you. You're sneaking through bushes. Hmm, this is not cool. Not cool at all. Oh, God, he looked right at me. No, 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 that was like a rabbit or something, dude. That's right, turn around. Go the other way, you big idiot. You are concealed. Is there anyone looking at him? Oh, my dicks. Are you kidding me right now? Oh. Shh, Prentice. Nothing personal. Shh, Prentice, it's okay. All right, we good, we good. Oh, there's this area back here. I probably should have dropped. I see you. Oh, come on. Not like this. They're not coming back. <laughs> well, no one ever said I was good at sneaking. Probably shouldn't have laid him. Oh, come on. You can barely almost kind of see him. Oh, shit. There's a dude right there. Here's the real question. Can I just take this guy out and explore? I might as well, right? If no one else is going to be here causing me problems. I'll just V this guy right in the old back of Rooney. Oh, there's a chest here and everything. Why am I always taking guys out while they're peeing? That's rude. That's just so, that's so rude. Oh, I put him down in the pee, too. There's toilet paper right there. That's useful. I can trade it to people. Oh, dig spot discovered. Add it to map. Where are these, where are these dig spots at? Exactly. Is it because I'm inside here and I'm not outside in the other part? Glass bottles. More glass bobby pins. Ooh, a flaming branch. I'll take that. All right, I mean, I guess I... Everything's fine. They're going to wake up super pissed. I wish I could get up there. Can I? Y'all, can I get up there? No. How do they? I guess it's inside. All right. Outside we go. Look at this. Look at this. I'll teach him to mess with me. Close it up all nice like. And we're good. Alright, so I'm back outside again. Where on the map are these? Where's the treasures? So go back over here. Avoid all the creepy houses. And turn this into this guy. Oh no, because he's in this creepy... Oh no, he's in the creepy town! Well, that is ass. This is still terrifying. What the hell? Is that... Okay, but it's daytime now, so there aren't going to be bobbies out, right? And everything's fine if I don't... Mess with the bobbies. Everything will be... Oh God, they just brutalized this person. Okay, um... 
Hello? It's me, your friend, Arthur. Guess we're not finding anything up here. Don't worry, I'm no trouble at all. Well, okay, they've seen me. They've it seen occurs to me that the locals may not be all that welcoming. Oh dear, let's try not to get killed, shall we? They put a dunce cap on that guy? Eating him. Arthur Wellesley, first Duke of Wellington, Wells. Beautiful little town. The I see you. Oh, damn Sometimes it. I wonder, would I even recognize him? I'd be 31 now. Would he recognize me? Would Please he want stop to? stop crying. Oh, boy. Oh, not like this. Uh, hello? Anyone out there? I still might. He had a moment and was like, You're hey. dressed like one. Shit. Slumming it, are we? Must be nice to have a closet. Over here, over here. You want to get thrashed? Yeah, go, go, go. Come in, come in. God, you're new here, aren't you? From the parade? Yes. Well, I. How could you tell? <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you how to survive your next five minutes, and in return, you'll give me your socks. Well, that's outrageous. Your funeral. Pull those off real quick. Why are they so angry? Because that suit you're wearing reminds them of all the jolly, proper, decent wellies who drove them out of the homes in the village. And now we're all cold and tired and starving to death. You better get a nice sharp rock and rip that to shreds. My uncle gave this to me for Christmas. Or they'll rip you to shreds. Shit. I hadn't thought there would be so many. Yeah, it's like the latest groovy nightclub, isn't it? People get a bad batch of joy. And it like flips a switch, and they can't take joy anymore. So they get chased out of the village. Been a lot of bad batches lately. So what happens if I rip up my suit? They invite me over for tea and biscuits? Then they really won't give a damn what you do, so long as you don't take things that don't belong to you. Or go up and punch someone in the nose. Now you can survive the next five minutes. Cheerio! <laughs> that is crazy. By the way, do you think the resistance groups that they mentioned earlier are messing up the batches? And that's why all this is happening? Also... Oh! Hey! It's all falling apart. The sen... <laughs> she was in the middle of conversation was like, oh, he's, he's listening. I got your medals. Thank you. You don't know what these mean to me. To know that some of us fall. To know that I fall. You're probably too young to remember. We stood tall in those days. In 42, we threw them back into the sea. Then they came back in 43. They weren't the same. I hate to be a bother, but the card to get across the bridge? Right. Oh, of course, yeah, sorry. Forgive an old man his memories. Well, good luck. I've got this key card, and I can power up the gate with the power cell. I guess I'm ready to cross the bridge. Okay, but first, can I talk to him some more? <laughs> I can wave. They could have taken them, but they didn't have to, did they? We brought them all to the station. Yeah, so we willingly gave up our kids. Didn't we go to school together? Miss Bing's class. It's hard when you can't trust your own memory, innit? Okay, so, there's a chest over here. I see that. Oh, come now. Come now, let me have your goods. Hell yes. Okay. Then I'm gonna get this weird-ass thing, whatever this is up here. Freak myself out with some f lies. Okay. I lied for you today at 4.15. Shh. That's not good, Percy. You're rubbish at lying. I was a good liar today. Shh. Who did you lie to? Mrs. Boyle. 
Mrs. Boyle came here? Her face was all red, and, and her voice was like Mom when she's angry. And I thought that you would ask me why she's angry. Why was she angry? I decided that she was angry. But I decided that she was angry because you were up in the tree next to Sally Boyle's bedroom window last night at 8.15 p.m. Oh, bloody hell. What exactly did he say? I told her that I was in the tree. Oh, Percy, that's very bad. No, Arthur, it's brilliant. Why is it brilliant? She won't make me be in trouble because I'm slow. You didn't have to do that. She told me not to do it again, so I promised I wouldn't. Thank you. I love you, Arthur. I love you too. Damn. And then Scott. I'm taking Scotch. Floating Scotch? I'm definitely... Ooh, there's a whole thing up there. Mind the side effects. A safe. I suppose if there's something valuable in this house, it ought to be in here. This house of God. Okay, yeah, let's do this. Ooh, Caltrops. The hell? All right. I mean, I guess there's a reason for everything. I'm sure I'll figure it out. Workbench. Rock. God, I have too many rocks. We can only have so many rocks. I get that. Uh, what was? There's something here, right? Nope, it's just rocks. Okay. Use workbench. Is there things I can make at the? Oh, a torn suit. Well, now I have that. And I can make a proper suit with the cloth scraps and a sewing kit. So I can have both? Because right now on my bod, I have a torn suit. Which I, I guess I... Now, if I was Percy, I'd just go promenading about wondering why everyone was staring. Expand? I mean, oh my god! What's so important about wearing clothes? Nice. Nice. Is it only in this one, or do I get that all the time? Do I have that on me all the time? Because that would be delightful. Let's find out, because I can make a normal suit, right? And then I can switch. I can F. I hope I don't lose this. I'm going to be real. Okay, cool. Oh! And I still have this all the entire time. Awesome. Great. That's what I get for exploring and finding stuff. Still want to make my my brawlies and my jollies, but okay. I don't want to waste all this stuff because I'm not sure if it'll be for other things later. Okay. Well, I don't think my suit is decent anymore. I could wear it around the garden district, but proper folk will have me pegged for a wastrel. Mm. So if I go, so I have to switch my suit once I make it across the bridge. More scotch. All right, sure. Got a uh, prestidigitator. Picked up a book back in 1964. People read books to learn how to do things better. You should read all you can find. It said what it did. It flashed so quickly, though, I didn't get a chance to read it. I have no idea what I just got. It prestidigitized. Alright, so just read books and do stuff better. Gotcha. Can I get up above? Are they yelling at me if I just shut? Ah, oh, here we go. I was about to say, if I just come outside, they're going to be like, Oh, never mind. His clothes are ruined. We're friends now. Ooh, getting rotten food. Delightful. All right, I guess. We make our fashion debut. Hello, everyone. I suppose he's just another rotten downer like us. <laughs> All right. Well, everything's good now. What a waste of time. Holy crap. Okay. Well, now we have to make it across the bridge. Great. But first, what if we explore this area? Oh, my God. There's so much to see, and it's all so depressing. You know, where's the payoff? Bring the strippers and boots! We do occasionally talk about video games. Bring the strippers and boots! Out of that town, 
Adventure Games. Bring the strippers and boots! Oh, thank God, I don't need pants now. Hey, JC! What are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a professional broadcast. Yeah, now sing the music. It's a professional broadcast. Bring the strippers and boots! It's a professional broadcast. Now here to ask and answer one simple question. It's a professional broadcast. You got it!